much. Good morning, everybody. Was that The Simpsons? <laughs> hey, everybody. Uh, the doctor. <laughs> the fucked up doctor. <laughs> Grand Rising. This is your Uncle 79, the Spiritual Savage. Uh, here to uh, give you guys a, a message this morning. I couldn't sleep. I mean, I, I went to bed early. And, uh, yeah, and I got up early. So, I mean, that's that's what happens when you go to bed early. You get up early. You do. I thought I'd at least be sleep to about six, but I guess I'm up now. Uh, thank you, Dad, for uh, giving me some days to give me the, the the opportunity to wake up, the breath of life. I appreciate you, Dad. I love you. Thanking us for thank you for bringing us here. Uh, it's very uh, it's very important to me. It is. Thank you, and thank you for joining me. What's up? Good morning. All right, um, spirit guys, spirit teams, and law enforcement. I appreciate you very much. I do, um, and I also would like to just say that you know, just the holiday season. You know, for anybody out there that uh, again thinks you're doing it by yourself, uh, you know, guy, you know, you could be. Let's just put it like this: uh, you're you're alone, but you're never. You, you may feel lonely, but you're never alone. Lonely is like hungry hunger. You may feel like you might need some social interactions or um, some social interactions. Like, oh, I might feel, I, ain't, I, I just, I ain't been around nobody. I just feel like I need to, because it, it's, 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 it's like an urge. It's like a, a function, a natural bodily function, like wanting to eat, you know. Uh, but you ain't, you know, but this is where, you, this is where it gets into interesting. Say you're hungry, you're starving. You don't have to eat with everybody. You can eat by yourself. The food that the food that you're gonna eat, though, just understand that's what it means by not being alone, because God is there to provide. You feel me? So, just because you're feeling uh, lonely doesn't mean you're alone. And so I'm, I'm saying that to say that uh, I am a, I am here to testify to the fact that uh, there are always if you are in the upright if you are somebody who's chosen if you're just a good a good person all the way around and life is kicking you around um, i'd encourage you to change your perspective mm -hmm. and, and 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 look at why what's going on why is life kicking you around if you know you don't deserve it uh you need to understand that this is probably part of the part of your mission or, or that there's a lesson in it and also understand too that if you, um, you know, if if, 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 if this, things seem like they are horrible right now and you're not gonna make it out, but you made it out the day before, you made it out the day before that, and you made it out the day before that, please understand that um, God is with you. The Most High God is with you, and there are people uh, that are working tirelessly, probably when you don't even know it, looking out for your silly ass on the holidays, away from their families. You know, a lot of people in law enforcement. You know, I, I ain't gonna lie, I used to be kind of rah, rah, rah against them. I really was. Just because I, 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 but I had to change my perspective on, the, I, I don't run the show for the, I don't run their show. They run their show. They know what they're doing. Um, and so, you know, I had to take a step back. I had to take a step back and um, really kind of uh, be grateful for um, the, the, the my moment to bitch and moan about law enforcement or the justice system. People are working for you. If you may, just may, just don't go back to the dark side. Is what I'm saying too. But 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 give some thanks to the people that are out there risking their lives for you, taking time away from their family and kids during the holidays. You know, because they're regular people too, and they got lives. But they they you know they but they understand their missions. So I appreciate you, and I thank you very much. It means a lot to me. All right, so new subscribers, current subscribers, and OGs. I appreciate you. I fucked with y'all too. You know what it is. Uh, intergalactic beings in the Galactic Federation. What's up, ancestors? I love you. Okay, um, and to the Narmix, I love you too. You just won't receive it the way you're supposed to. It's not my problem. All right, let's let's get it. I think I forgot somebody, but yeah. Uh, let's return to Cinder Ten Times Fold, guided with love and light. Things that do not belong to the collective and me, some more to be, some more to be, some more to be, and so she gonna fall off that bed. Uh, also, too, let's. Uh, Ask that all evil lines go blind and all your hustling demons go deaf. You feel me? 
Uh, I just had this weird thought. <laughs> you don't see me rolling around like that, do you? <laughs> yeah, well, it is what it ain't. All right, let's get to this. Um, I don't know if there's, I, I had some dreams, but I don't know. I don't know what they're for. I don't even remember them. Not right now, anyway. All right, so um, let's get some overall energy. Let's... <laughs> I did have a thought though the other day. Um, so ley lines. Does anybody know what ley lines are? Well, I I, I, it, the, the, I don't know where the, I know where it came from, but I just randomly it just popped into my head, or maybe not so randomly. We don't believe in coincidences around here, okay? But ley lines. Ley lines are. Uh, they, you know, I did a little bit more research on it, and you know how people always, you know, we do live in a world now where people have to understand five, five, five is on the clock too. Expect the unexpected. What? Um, but truly, uh, we live in a world now where people don't understand certain things, or they're not a part of it, or they don't want people to know the truth. They like to, they like to uh, marginalize, or uh, what is that? What is it, what is that called? patronize you know like they have a patron kind of patronization is that a word well anyways they um that's not the word i'm looking for uh but they trivialize things and so imaginary lines or um people have thought that th maybe these lines exist between historical you know major historical sites uh landmarks and, and such so something like stonehenge um, and the ancient Mayan temples, you know, there there was to say there would be ley lines that connect these ancient historical uh, landmarks or, or uh, figures, structures. I had a thought. So, you know, in the collective, um, the 144, um, or not even that, let's not, let's not limit it, you know what I'm saying? Let's just say star seeds or intergalactic light workers. Um, but, mm, yeah, chosen. I, you know, however you want to look at it. You know, I don't want to make. I don't want to make anybody feel excluded. So we'll just say that if you feel like you're here on a mission, a very divine mission, a special mission, that you are an interstellar, you are an intergalactic being. And um, I just got to make sure because you know when she get like this, sometimes she like to mark her territory on my shit, not with her mouth either. You feel me? yeah um but uh and i'm i am one of those people too like my grandkids i always talk about my grandkids too when i'm when i have them uh so if you don't like it too fucking bad okay um but in any given event I'm, i feel like um the reason why we can pick up on each other's energy we can help each other heal is because um we have ley lines we are these ancient historical figures and objects. Hold on, y'all. Yeah, okay. So I had to go get some water anyway. But when you get a minute, please like, share, subscribe, hit that notification button, that subscribe button. I think I said something twice. But just select the all options so that you know all of my uploads upload. You feel me? But I kind of feel like we have... Um, so, you know, look at like, you know, we're, uh, we are incarnated gods and goddesses. Um, you know, kings and queens from uh, years prior, centuries prior, galaxies, dimensions, realms. Um, but the things that connect us, that's why these the synchronicities and things occur between us. Um, that's the reason why you can, you know, to, uh, go on YouTube and there's somebody on there that has a message for you. Or you walking down the street. It's kind of like I had that conversation with the guy at the bus stop the other day. You know, there was, you know, in a... In a in a normal world, there's no reason why he would have been talking to me, especially with where he was from and our skin colors and just like the days that we're in, like I, I feel like um, any other person would have just ignored him. But because there was a, there was some type of energetic, there was a spiritual connection there, soulmate kind of energy. He could have possibly been like a soulmate of mine from a previous life because, you know, soulmates aren't supposed to always stick around for the rest of your life. They come and they teach us a lesson and they move around. Not not in the way that karmics do soulmates they come they enrich our lives uh, or you enrich theirs you share an experience and you're better you're better for it and they and everybody goes their ways i'm figuring that because we have these ley lines between us we are these ancient historical 
figures or, or structures, energies, energies, you feel me? And so that just had me thinking, um, each of us has a, each of us, um, have these ley lines between all of us, especially if we're here to the collective, we, we say we're the, the collective. So it's a collective group of us and, uh, or a collection. Let's just say a collection with, like with serial numbers. No, not like that weird, uh, that weird shit with like barcodes. I'm just saying that there, there are ties that bind us all. Um, and, uh, we need to just, I feel like we just should keep that in mind. You know, um, I think it, it will help us grow stronger. So no matter where you are in this world, if you're if you're if you're part of the collective, you're never alone. There are those imaginary lines <laughs> that keep us together. I hope that helps somebody. Something said, grab the Rebel Oracle deck to get the overall energy. So we're gonna do it. My card place my card holders are in the other room. I'm not gonna get them. I don't feel like it. Sometimes I wish these these cats were like kids. You know, it's what 4:59 a.m. on December 5th, 2023. It's 31 degrees Fahrenheit and cloudy. But I was getting more or less to the time. Um, you know, when your parents will wake you up, go in there and give me a couple. Uh, call you all the way off from out. To, you playing with your friends outside? Yes, my. Could, give me a cup of water. I wish you could do that with cats. Dogs. I'm pretty sure you probably could train a dog to um, do that, but. No, I, I, matter of fact, no, I don't. I don't want no, no. I, I damn sure don't want no dog going to give me a glass of water. No offense to dog on you, but dogs, cats are cleaner than dogs. They just are. Okay. All right, let's get it. Can I get the overall energy from the Rebel Oracle deck? That was quick. Put the fucking phone down. Too much screen time is making you awkward and sad. Go talk to a live person. Somebody on their phone too much, of course. I mean, but it's not even just about the phone. I just think that this is uh, one of these messages that could go across the board for anything. So somebody's spending too much time um, not getting social. It doesn't sound like a horse galloping. Damn, you going to my diet, motherfucker. That's a big ass nickel. Uh, but uh, somebody is um, somebody needs some social interaction. They, see how this works? The exchange, like the the, the channeling. Somebody is uh, maybe ignoring your relationship. Maybe you're, maybe you're just maybe you're not maybe you're not seeing the world around you for what it what it has to offer. And you may, yeah, you may, you might want to, you know, you could be on these online dating apps, uh, which I would probably, well, I would never do those again. Okay. Maybe you're spending a lot of time on social media. You're ignoring what is, cause you know, a lot of things that we see on Instagram, Facebook, hell, even YouTube, um, Twitter, all these different things are, uh, you know, these are, uh, what the world wants you to see, what people want you to see instead of what, what's really going on. And so it says, go talk to a live person. I just got to somebody uh maybe somebody's working a lot too or you know just doing taking care of a lot of business talking to a live person can also represent uh you know you're calling into a customer service line you know what i'm saying and, and you just want to talk to a live person so maybe somebody's spending too much time in uh, working a bit like you're not paying you're working too much or you're or you're too busy worried about bills and taking care of home like you're just too busy focused on things that don't involve uh, the enrichment of somebody else's life around you. Take the energy as it resonates. Shit. Uh, let's get. Um, let's talk about catitudes. Let's use catitudes. I hope everybody has a grand motherfucking rising today and a high ascension. I hope. So we got the Queen of Wands and the uh, Four of Pentacles. So we could be talking about an Aries Leo Sagittarius. We could be talking about somebody who's a little witchy poo, who got a little magic in her. Uh, Aries Leo Sagittarius again. Uh, male or female gender is not, it's not specific. Um, but yeah, uh, put the phone down. Let it go. Just let it go. You know what I used to do at my house uh, well, some years ago? My house was the hub. Um, so on Thursdays, when people would come, because people we kicked it at my house all the time. 
Um, and not like that kind of kicking in, but you know, just like everybody was always at my house. Like we cook, we got, got we cook a lot of food. We listen to music. We drink. Uh, we play games. We talk. We just it was like a family. Yeah, each of us, each of us were you know weren't really close. Well, not close like they, we didn't fuck with our families, but everybody just was at a distance from their family, and so we would all just get together and just hang out, laugh, and joke, like family. But on Thursdays, I would when people came over, um, they had to put their phone in the box. Like nobody could be on their phone, at least for for a few hours anyway. You know, we, do, we there was a lot of there was a lot of a, a time a time allotted for us to sit around and talk or just catch up with each other or just you know just get a break from the phones because there's nothing worse <laughs> confirmation. <laughs> May I just put the phone in the box? But there's nothing worse than being around somebody and you're trying to make a connection and a motherfuckers on their phone all the damn time. So Queen of Wands energy, whoever you are, Aries, Leo, Sagittarius. Um, I'm gonna need for you to put the phone down. Put your phone down. Let it go. And uh, your 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 boyfriend or girlfriend or your kids are actually talking to you. It's not just mindless chatter. All right. Yeah. What's this? This could also represent to. Um, I think it's like get your ass off social media. Oh, you, somebody on the phone being slick. Maybe somebody's sneaking and using their phone. Maybe your kid's sneaking and using the phone. Maybe you're at work sneaking and using your phone during a meeting. Whatever the case is, somebody being slick, though. What else? Thank you. We got the Ten of Cups. Okay, I get where this is going. Thank you, Spirit. Okay. One more. Thank you, Spirit. Okay. So there's three different situations here going on. That's what I'm picking up on. But there was an Aries Leo Sagittarius energy initially that the Spirit wanted you to put let go of your phone. It's not going to kill you. You got motherfuckers in your eye like you with your cold, dead hands. Well... If that's the, if that's the deal you want to make with spirit, slow slow singing and flower bringing. If, if if you would much rather hold on to that phone after this message, okay. Somebody on their phone being slick. These people don't know what they do. What are they doing on their phone, spirit? Spirit said that's the truth. Mm-hmm. Leo maybe somebody that owns a cat or cats a cat clarify seven of swords and string I'm trying to hide something I'm trying to keep something in the dark Leo mm -mm. what are they hiding Yeah. They're backstabbing you. Mm-hmm. This Leo energy. Betrayal. Backstabbing. Backstabbing. What is the betrayal? Mm-mm. So if you run a Leo that's always on their phone, oh baby, I'm just working. No, they're not. They're not just working. But they working. A friend of mine is bed working. He could be bed working. Okay. Clarify the ten of swords, please. They talking to a gold digger. Mm-hmm. They stabbing you in the back for a gold digger. Mm-mm. Spirit said that's the truth. They giving that. They they they're taking all that love that you're giving them and they're taking that and they're giving it to someone else it's kind of like energy harvesting energy they're, they're fucking with a gold digger they take it from you there's somebody i just i just saw and i heard it was somebody from church so they took they did cheat on you with somebody from church gold digger from church clarify the queen of pentacles in the reverse 
trying to what did I say? What did I say? You probably been like this. Mm-hmm. Why they not talking to me? Why are they sleeping on the sofa? Why are they late? Why are they late coming back home from work? Why are they roll over in the bed and not paying no attention to me? Will you please pay attention to me. They got you. They got you in some misery, baby. Mm-hmm. Yeah, they're gonna. They, you're being tennis sorted. Are you about to find out? Yeah, bad juju, bad judgment. He, they're using bad judgment. You're using bad judgment, or somebody getting some bad juju. Judgment. You're not calling. You're not. You're not calling it for what it is. This. This is what the also means. You're not. You're not calling them out. Spirit says, call them out. You're being, you're being, you're, you're being cheated on, baby. That's what I heard. Yep, this is all. It's over. Once you call judgment, it's over. Okay, we don't even need to. That's sorry, sorry. You had to find out like this, but that's what I heard. So we saw in the cards. So somebody needs to put their phone down and pay attention to their kids, their family. You're neglecting your family by uh, being on that phone, where you could be working a lot. You could be doing a lot. What is this? So from this last energy, there, I'm paying attention to what was on the top of the deck. Stop fucking whining. No one wants to listen to that shit. Complaining makes you weak. You have the strength to change your world, so do it. That's for you. Okay. So let's let's. Uh, well, there's another card on the top of the deck. I'm just going to pull from the top because Spirit is alerting me to the top of the, the Rebel deck. So for the Ten of Cups, this is family. You could be a water sign of Cancer, Scorpio, or Pisces. Uh, but there's an exclamation point. Figure shit out on your own. Okay. What do you need to figure out on your own instead of looking on your phone? Let's see. About your family. Clarify. Clarify. Mm. All right, so th these car came out sideways. It's the three of pentacles. Work. So you're worried about work. Death came out in the sideways too. So this could, uh, you know, when things come out in the sideways. It's like a teeter totter and kind of thing. You you don't know where. Uh, things are going. I'm picking up on the fact you don't know where things are going with your job. Your job is up in the air. You don't know uh, what to do. You don't know if your job is going to end or not. You don't know. Uh, this could be about transformation. Oops, excuse me. You're having issues at work, though. Mm hmm. Whatever, however you want to look at it. You're having issues at work. What's going on at work? You don't know what's going on. You don't know if you're going to get canned. You don't know if you're going to stay there. But you're spending a lot of time on your phone uh, ignoring the problem. You're, maybe you're asking a lot of people online. Maybe you're going to a lot of different sites. You know, it's kind of like listening to a lot of readings. At some point, you just, and even for me, like, you know, I have to pull back. You, I mean, you have to know. Um, where to go for your information? Everybody, you can't go everywhere for because all the information out there ain't gonna be for you, and you you can't take everybody's advice either. The Knight of Swords. That's about uh, talks about spying. Could be spying, but this is definitely uh, social media. You're all over social media trying to figure out something about your job. And uh, you got your family there is what I'm hearing. Um, this doesn't even have to be about wife and kids. Figure shit out on your own. I'm picking up on the fact that maybe you should um, consider uh, things that other... Talk to your family members. They're real people. Stop going uh, Stop going online looking at... So yeah, stop being... Because you're, you're, you're being a damn fool. You're doing foolish shit. I'm picking up on the fact that you that you're thinking about going into something else like you just about to, don't take your money and do no dumb shit yeah, here we go with the truth again yeah you need to go within mm-hmm you need to go within or maybe you have a wife who's highly intuitive or a girlfriend or, or some 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 feminine energy could be a male or female doesn't matter 
could be a Cancer, Scorpio, Pisces. Doesn't really matter either. Uh, but could heavy, would, would, could really be a Pisces. Pisces are very psychic. Maybe you need to go speak to a psychic. Hello, come through spirit. Maybe you need to go talk to a psychic to help you kind of uh, figure out what's going on. Yeah, there's going to be a victory. And spirit says this, but yeah, that's the truth, Ruth. We got the Ace of Wands. You go to the psychic, they're going to give you a clear, correct, and concise way to go for victory for your new beginning. Because you're, you're like this right now. You're, you're teeter-tottering. You're juggling. See? Told you. Yep. She's going to tell you how to get there. Mm-hmm. And, and But she's also going to tell you how not to make the wrong like, like the wrong investment. And she's going to tell you where to go online to apply for this job. Because, again, there's a page of swords. I mean, this was the Knight of Swords. I'm sorry. Knight of Swords. This is fast-moving action. Uh, fast moving action you're, you're you're moving you're moving really fast you're chasing something you're chasing something online you're not gonna be able to find it there but then the, she's gonna tell you where to go online to find what you're looking for if this mother so yeah that's for you there you go go see a psychic uh, a, a card reader or psychic whoever uh, pay for a reading then we got the last one put the fucking phone down Again, too much screen time is making you awkward and sad. Go talk to a live person. Okay. We got the uh, seven of cups in reverse. This could uh, this could mean illusion. This is the mask is falling off. Illusions are you seen through the illusions? Eight eleven was on the clock. I don't know why that's significant. Look it up. All right. So, get some fucking sleep. You are being an ass because you are fucking tired. Now, face the pillow now. So this is about illusions. <laughs> what are you doing on your phone? You're looking. You know what you're doing? Yeah. Are you social media stalking somebody? Or you're trying to... You're you're doing you're seeing you're seeing through the illusions on what you're looking at on your phone, you, you, and, and you're not it's it's causing you not to sleep. Um, let's 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 shuffle this a little bit. Let's get some more energy. Again, like, share, follow, hit that notification bell, and that subscribe button. Okay. I'd also like to thank people making financial contributions to myself and the channel. We really appreciate it around these parts. You're gonna get it back tenfold. Okay. Yeah, you need to stop whatever you're doing on this phone. Stop. Uh, or the illusions have stopped but I think that what I'm picking up on here maybe you're casting illusions you could be casting illusions you could also be a water sign cancer Scorpio Pisces you're casting illusions you're too yeah you, you just you're posting you're posting you're posting things that uh, you think make you look popular maybe Yeah, see, you're trapped in your head about some shit. Mm-hmm. Keep. I just heard keeping up with the Joneses. Nope. Clarify the Eight of Swords. Thank you. No. I didn't mean to yell at you. I'm sorry. Sorry. <laughs> Thank you. <laughs> okay, so wow. Okay, so this this took a turn. Yeah, you've been social media stalking. You've been putting out there everything's all good, but you but you know that this somebody done broke your damn heart. They left you for somebody else. So your marriage, marriage went down the drain. Mm-hmm. They with somebody else? Are you seeing now they the, the mask come fell off this motherfucker you're married to? Now you seeing a social media stalking baby. I'm trying to tell you, trapped in your head about that shit. You staying up all night long, poor baby, poor baby. Mm -mm. You are oh, oh shit. It's no somebody. You, I got. You. Thank you, Holy Spirit. You have been in a relationship with somebody, and shit's just kind of going a little. Psh, like, like like there's a cool day day like some things that went cold and so you're uh you social media stalking you're the mad you're seeing through the bullshit you were in a third party and didn't even know it this motherfucker's married i 
I have to honestly say, out of everything I've gone through, oh no, I, I, I was gonna say, I, I, you know, I have um, two o'clock could be uh, two or one. Two o'clock could be significant. The time in the back, or V, looks like a V too, but two o'clock. The way the two o'clock could be significant. It could be. What else? Burdens, I told you. What? Who's, who's in the house? Who in the house? Burdens. So now you got burdens. Bag of lady. See, I, I'm telling you, somebody's carrying around a lot of baggage. It ain't me. I put them bags down, baby. I ain't missing the bus. Okay. Yep, we ain't regret. Because you got truth and clarity about your situation, about how somebody was very highly unfair for you. Okay? Hi, unfair to you. Somebody's being slick. I mean, not necessarily slick, but. Mm -mm. Or maybe this could be your ass now. You, 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 after you got that truth and clarity, you're like, yo, he's mine now. I'm going to do anything. Well, you're, you're, you're going to make the wrong moves. You don't want to do that. Don't work like that. It, it literally don't work like that. It's not going to. Yeah. Yeah. Uh, uh, yeah. You're going to. You're really going to fumble the bag, fumble the ball. you really going to fuck your whole shit up. And you might get your ass whooped. Okay. Because you, you do this, you're not protected. You're in a third party anyway. That's some shit that the divine is not okay with. Even if you did, now that you know, you're still going after somebody after you done found out that they married. It's not, you're not protected. That, that lady might beat your ass. Yeah. Two of swords, yeah, you don't, you, 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 yeah, yeah, you're at a crossroads now. So now you're trying to make a choice about what to do. Or maybe you're going to go for an eye for an eye. How are you going to go for an eye for an eye for something that didn't belong to you in the first fucking place? That's my, yeah, because now you, because you're not getting the attention of some whack ass emperor. Okay. Low vibrational ass nigga. Go heal. Let it go. And heal. Go heal. And then that's how you're going to get to the Ten of Swords. That's how you're going to get to what you really want. Let it go and go heal. You see, this is healing. The star. And then you're going to let it go. Okay. Or maybe he's an Aquarius. Maybe you need to let the Aquarius go. But either way it goes, it's healing there. And to get to your Ten of Cups. Ten of Pentacles. Spirit says that's the truth. You can do it by yourself. Okay. Because while he's getting that bad juju, you better get the fuck away from him, okay? Sell off the common waters because the secret's fucking out. And that's the end of this shit. Take the energy as it resonates. His name could be Will. Somebody, Will, Williams, something. Your name could be Will, shit. I I I I Yeah. I think that's the end. We don't need no Oracle card, okay? I'm gonna close out this reading. Thank you for joining me. I'm your Uncle 79 the Spiritual Savage. Remember, you grow, I grow, I grow, you grow, we grow together. What do we learn? Uh that uh that you might you might fuck uh, listen. If it ain't yours, it ain't yours. Let it go. Okay? That's the last part. But what we need to learn is that sometimes maybe we just need to detach from social media, internet, take a look around and see what's what's there for us. And stop taking advice from everybody you get, everybody you meet online. I don't do that. Okay? You you take what resonates and leave what don't. But stop looking all around for answers for things that you could answer for yourself. And remember, you always have good people around you that are probably a lot cooler than some um, deep face A some deep fake AI bullshit person or somebody on a false profile or some tarot card reader thing that's only reading cards instead of being an intuitive because in card a lot of people did just read cards are reading cards to tell you what they know you want to hear because the enemy is whispering in their ear about what you want okay all right I love you guys thank you for joining me Uncle 79 Spiritual Savage as always Love and light around this bitch. Deuces. Seven.